Hello guys, welcome to another interesting video on Calf Shadow. Do click the subscribe button and don't forget to hit the bell icon next to it to be notified for future exciting content. Great, let's get into it. Hello guys and welcome to today's video. In today's video, we are going to learn how to prepare and submit your take-home exam from start to finish. Okay, we are going to learn the steps involved in preparing your take-home exam from start to finish. Very simple and straightforward. Okay, so the first step is actually to copy your document from your phone to your laptop. Okay, copy your document from your phone to your laptop. Just connect your phone to your laptop or your computer and locate the file and just copy it to your to your computer. Alright. So once you have that done like mine here, you can just also the next step is just to copy and paste it again. Just like you are duplicating the file on your desktop. The reason why we are duplicating it is because we don't want to overwrite the original file. Okay. It's not going to affect anything. You can just duplicate it okay so we are going to work on the duplicated version of the original file so you go ahead and click on it once you have that clicked on you move on to enable editing okay so once you have that selected you can now proceed to edit your cover page so let's start university of professional studies that is the school degree program mind you if you are reading a degree program or a diploma program you can change this if it's a degree you keep it that way if it's a diploma program you just type all in capital please diploma program okay so that is the first changes you have to make now we move on to change the next ones where we have the xx in red okay we make changes to the xx that are in color red okay so we move on to faculty of information and technology studies okay if that is your faculty pertaining to that particular course you can maintain it okay beautiful so you move on and click i mean erase the xx in red for the faculty Department of Information Technology Studies. If that is your department, you can maintain it and just clean the XX. If it is not your department, you can start cleaning it. So, the department in regards to that course, okay, please take note. So, this is Department of Communication Studies. The next step is your level you can maintain it if you are in level 100 or make changes to it now you enter your course code if you are a degree student with regards to that particular course you are reading it would have a course code so you can clean it the xx here and type your course code okay beautiful if you are done you now move on to the name of the course all right which is um in this case business communication okay when you are done you just move your cursor to the front here and take off the x beautiful so the next step is your start date exam is starting on monday for some of us so we can maintain this and just clean the x here maintain this one and also clean the x please take note the exam is 48 hours so the start date and the end date should be taken into consideration okay so the next point is to enter your index number you click on the box just like I have and enter your index number.
okay the next point also is for you to enter your digital address i'm going to be releasing a video on how to capture your digital address for your particular location that video will be coming up soon so you guys should be expecting that video okay so your digital address for illustration purposes i'm just going to type in any digital address at random but you shouldn't do that for your exam you should just use your actual location this is just for illustration purposes okay now that you have done or you have edited your cover page we are almost through so just click out of your digital address box and go to insert and go to blank page because you are inserting another page which is going to house our answers if you didn't see that i'm going to do that again after inserting your digital address click out of the box anywhere out of the box you see this cursor here move to insert and click on blank page so this will give you an empty page with borders around it just like this one at this time this one is empty so this is actually going to provide you with a space where you can paste your answers or type your answers in there okay very simple and straightforward it is also important to take note that you must first create a document which has your answers in word okay so type your document for all your answers okay when you are done you just copy and paste them into this blank page that we have here okay so i have a document i want to paste into this blank page for illustration purposes so i open it i want to locate that quickly okay so it's here so i open it and i quickly want to copy the first paragraph of my answer in this situation this is my answer with regards to that particular exam once again this is only for illustration purposes so starting from the first paragraph click and drag so you cover everything and you are satisfied when you are satisfied you you press on the key combination Control plus c okay then you go and paste it into the page or the empty blank pages you created here when you are done press ctrl v beautiful so this will actually paste your work into the blank pages you realize that it will successfully open other pages if it can't house everything in one page okay beautiful so we have our cover page neatly edited here with all the relevant information then the next pages are the answers to the exam okay now the next thing we want to do is to save this particular work in pdf please take note all our take-home examinations are supposed to be submitted in the pdf format okay so we want to save this in pdf i already have created a video that illustrates how to save your documents in pdf if you haven't watched it please go ahead to watch it but i'm then going to go over that again so you click on file when you are satisfied that you want to save this in pdf click on file go to save as go to browse beautiful then you move to desktop so after clicking your desktop you now want to name your file and we have already been given instructions as to how to name our file that is your course code space then you type in your index number so your course code for example m104 space out then you type your index number and it's in pdf so we have our cover page first followed by our answers followed by our answers okay guys 
So this is how to actually prepare and submit your take home exam from start to finish. If you did enjoy today's video, don't forget to give it a like and also hit the subscribe button and the notification bell if you are new to this channel. Do also click on any of the tabs you can see here to watch my previous videos I have uploaded. Stay safe and have a good day.